privilege to honor you today. You have many friends and family here, uh, as well as um, teammates and fellow students here to honor you. Darren Sackett, he's with his parents, Tom and Sandy Sackett. Darren's committed to play baseball at Lake Erie College. Darren's current GPA is a 3.1. He's a first team all conference in baseball. He, ha he holds a 304 career average in hitting, two time varsity defensive player of the year, and he's a two time captain. He obviously was part of our state football championship team. He's in partners club. He is on the high school honor roll. He is in a mentoring internship for students with special needs. It is our privilege to introduce Darren Sackett. <laughs> we are proud to introduce Danny Krusel. He, his parents are Mike and Julie. Julie's here with us today. Julie Krusel. <coughs> Danny's committed to play baseball at Lord University. Danny is a two-year varsity letterman in baseball. He was also part of our state championship football team and has been a member of our wrestling team. He is a student council member here at Loveland High School, senior service leader, and as I said, and he's very proud of the starting center of the state championship football team. And Danny said he's going to be principal of Loveland High School one day. <laughs> Danny Krusel. baseball at Lake Erie College. Brian has a current GPA of a 3.1. He is a three-year varsity starter, pitcher, and outfielder for our Loveland Tigers team. All-conference as a junior, honorable mention All-City as a junior, team captain as a sophomore and senior, team most valuable player pitcher as a junior. Brian was also on our successful golf team as well. Um, at earning first team all conference awards in golf, and he is a member of our Lake crew. Let me introduce, is proud to introduce Brian Bullock and his parents. Brian is committed to play baseball at Lake Erie College. Brian. <laughs> to introduce to you Sydney Thomas with her parents Brian and Christy Thomas. <coughs> Sydney has committed to play volleyball at Otterbein University next year. Her current GPA is a 3.98. She is a three-year varsity starter her senior year. She was captain, first team ECC, third team All-City, inquired Division I All-Star, Loveland Tigers most valuable player, best, de best offensive player, and on the all-academic team. Her junior year, first team FAVC, honorable mention All-City, Loveland Tiger Best Offensive Player, Tiger Award, and all-academic team. She's also a six-year member with the Cincy Classics Volleyball Club on the national level. She is a volunteer at Bethesda North Hospital, Camp Intervention Camp Counselor, She's a link crew member here at Loveland High School, also a senior service leader at Loveland High School, CYO volleyball official, and she fits it all in. She has a part-time job as well. I don't know how she does that. Actually, she has two part-time jobs. So, Sydney, congratulations on your future volleyball career at Otterbein College. <laughs> our pleasure to introduce to you Matt Vogt. He is here today with his mother Danielle and his club coach Eric Rothwell. 
Matt is committed to play soccer at Wheeling Jesuit University next year. His current GPA is a 3.8. He is a state semifinalist with his club team, FAVC Honorable Mention in 12-13 season. First team all ECC this year, his senior season. And in 2012-2013, Sportsman of the Year. He is an assistant coach with the U13 Girls Cincinnati United soccer team. He is a summer volunteer at Little Miami River Cleanup, a link crew member here at the high school, and a senior service project leader here at the high school. Matt, congratulations on your future career in soccer. It's our pleasure to introduce to you Lindsay Miller. She's with her parents, Steve and Kathy Miller. Lindsay is committed to the diving team next year at the University of Cincinnati. Lindsay's current GPA is a three is a four point three zero four. She placed eleventh at sectionals, thirteenth at districts and she was second place at our ECC championship. First year diving, she just started in November and she was able to accomplish all this. Wow. She is a 10 year member of the Queen City tr trampoline and tumbling competition team and she also plays the violin and cello for the Loveland High School Orchestra as well as being a member of the Loveland High School National Honor Society. Lindsay, congratulations on your future diving career. It's our pleasure to introduce to you Seth Brannock with his parents, George and June. Seth will be wrestling at American University next year. Seth placed third at Nationals. He is our ECC Wrestler of the Year this year state qualifier. He's a two-time ECC champion, sectional champion, district runner-up. He was fourth at Ironman, and he's the fourth all-time wins leader now for Loveland High School. He, is the, he also holds a, he's <coughs> second in career points, first in points in the single season, and first in pins, and first in pins in a single season. He's had a very good senior year by all measures. He also played lacrosse for two years here at the high school. It's our pleasure to introduce to you Seth, who will be wrestling at American University. Now. Olivia Stanton with her parents, Dave and Teresa Stanton. Olivia is committed to play softball at the University of Indianapolis next year. Olivia's current GPA is a 4.2. She is a four-year varsity starter, first team all-conference, first team all-metro. She has won the Scholar Athlete Award, played on the Adidas Futures All-Star Team representing the Midwest. She is in Tigers in Service, National Honor Society, and is a student athletic training assistant here at Loveland High School on the state championship team I will have you at, so <laughs> help us get there. It's my pleasure to introduce to you Olivia Stan playing softball. <laughs> it's our pleasure to introduce to you Annie Rich. She is with her parents, Amy and Mark Rich. She's committed to play softball at Berea College. Annie's current GPA is a 3.5. She is the starting varsity shortstop. She's played four years of select and travel softball as well. She's a member of student council. She's a representative, fellowship of Christian athletes. She is a youth group leader and works at the Indian Hill Winter Club. 
It is our pleasure to introduce Annie Rich going to Berea College. <laughs> Great job, Annie. It's our pleasure to introduce Olivia Pfeiffer with her parents, Candace and Brian Pfeiffer. Olivia is committed to play softball at Walsh University. Her current GPA is a 3.2. She has been second team all-conference, first team all-conference, defensive player of the year, sports person of the season, team MVP, and she is a four-year varsity <coughs> letterman in softball. And she has a six-career no-hitter. She also has been involved in youth group, and part of the Partners Club here at Loveland High School. Olivia, congratulations as you pursue your softball career. You want to flip your song? Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. It's our privilege to introduce Trevor Simons. He is with Simon. He is with his parents, Gary and Susie Simon. Trevor is committed to play baseball at Ball State University. Trevor's current GPA is a 3.5. He was first team in baseball his freshman, sophomore, and junior year. Team captain as a junior and senior. Defensive player of the year as a sophomore. Offensive player of the year his junior year. He also played varsity basketball for three years. Again, congratulations to Trevor going on to play baseball in college.